Varinian steel. Varinian is the name of the guy who found this steel. This method, the principle of calculation of the moment, is the following. The moment of a force about a point is equal to the sum of the moment of its components about that point. So the moment Varinian steel. And to illustrate this, I will choose an example simple one okay the moment of a, of a force about any point is equal to the sum of the moments of its components about this point so we have to find the components of this force about the components of the force and try to find the moment about the point of let's Look at this example. So what I am trying to, to calculate now is the moment of these one, two, three forces about O. Oh. So the rule is when you of the principle of the moment, the principle of moment, a moment of a force about a point is equal to the sum of the moments of the forces about this point. So that means I have to calculate the moment of this force about O plus the moment of this force about O plus the moment of the 300 newtons about O. So if I choose my orientation of the moment as clockwise, it's arbitrary, I can choose any direction. I can start for the, with this one, for the first one. For the first one it will be force times distance. Force is 600 newtons times the distance from the point O, which is 1 meter, plus this force, its line of action is here, okay, and the distance that separates this force of 500, 500 newtons is 1 meter plus 2 meters plus this distance here, D. So, but, you have to notice that, because I've choose, I have chosen the positive moment as clockwise, clockwise, these 500 newtons will make the system turn into the other side. Anti-clockwise. So, I have to take this into consideration for the for my calculation otherwise I will get something so uh, now we have to add the moment of this force 500 newtons which is force times distance and the distance that separates the line of action to the point O is 1 meter plus 2 plus this distance d and this distance d is fine is 2.5 cosine uh, d equals 2.5 meters cosine 45 2.5 cosine 45 but there is a problem here, it's not a problem, I have to attract your attention. I put plus in a way that we have to add moments, but this moment of this force 
is making the system turn in anti-clockwise, counterclockwise. So if I I have choose my positive moment as clockwise, this force will make the system turn in anti-clockwise. Therefore, I have to put here minus. This is the moment of the first force, the moment of the second force, and now the moment of this third force, line of action. Okay, and here this distance d dash, this distance d dash, I find it here, which is 2.5 sine 45. 2.5 sine 45 degrees and is making the system turn in clockwise therefore I have to put plus 300 newtons times 2.5 sine 45 you put this into your calculations, into your calculator, and you will find uh, okay, we can do it. It's uh, I, I did this calculation, I it's finally you can verify it. It's one. Two, five, four newtons meter, and that we just, you will find minus, and this minus means simply it's anti-clockwise because I have chosen the positive sense rotating clockwise. The minus that means this moment is making the system turning anti. Clockwise. So we have seen here how to calculate the moment of three forces about an axis and how to find the resultant moment. Thank you.